Hello my beauties and welcome back to another video. I am going to be swatching for you these gorgeous 9D cat eye gels that I got from Azure Beauty. I got them from AliExpress and they took about 20 days to come here and I just cannot wait to swatch these for you because they are so beautiful. So this is 001. They don't actually have names, they've just got numbers and after doing this I realized I didn't actually show them to you in numerical order but here we go. So the first one was a green colour, this is more like a purpley, shimmery colour. And this one is a bluey sort of colour. And I dropped it, yes. There we go, back again. And there we go, that one is also like another bluey, I don't know how to describe these colours because they're just something that I've not actually seen before. They're just so beautiful, they really really are beautiful. Here we go, we've got an orangey red. So as I said, these are 9D cat eye gels, I've never tried anything like this before. These are my nails, I have done the base coat already on them. And as per instructions, you need to apply a thin layer of a black. Apparently, this makes the colour pop out even more. So I'm just going to apply a thin layer of black onto my nails and cure this for 60 seconds. Now, because it is quite a dark colour, um, I cured it for a little bit longer than I normally would, just so that it actually cures all the way through. So as I said, I got these from AliExpress. They took 20 days to arrive and I was just so eager for them to come. Um, you know, because I was really, really excited to try these out for you. And I did get a lot of compliments on the look. So I'm expecting a few people to want to try these out, hopefully. Just trying to be as careful as I can, obviously not trying to flood the cuticles and not make a mess so I don't have a lot of cleaning up to do later. And again, as you can see, I'm using my non-dominant hand. So yeah, this was really, really tricky to try and keep stable and be in line of the camera. Still a learning process, but I'm getting better at it every day. Here we go, just capping the free edge and faffing as I usually do. There we go, so that's all cured. And now to have fun with these. Ah, it was so hard trying to choose which colours to use. This is my chrome brush, which I got from Chroma Gel. It's a chroma brush. Oh gosh, I just love these colours, they're just so beautiful. Just look at what they look like when they're on that back, black background. They're really magical. So because I got six colours, and I've obviously got five fingers, I decided to use two colours on one hand, on one finger, sorry. So I could get to use all of them. So the whole idea with this is that you get um, a magnetic stick in the pack, and you put the magnetic stick close to the gel and you're supposed to see it shimmer and move. Although I was a bit disappointed with this mag mag particular magnet I got because I couldn't see a lot of the effect. So in the end, I changed over to another magnet, which I got from another kit, um, just so you could actually see what it looked like. So there's me trying to decide what color to go with this one. So yeah, I just thought the blue and the green might look nice together. And I did cure that layer of green before going in to apply the blue. So I don't want it to smudge or run into each other. This is just such an amazing, an amazing color. I just couldn't think of anything prettier than this, to be honest. It's probably going to be one of my go-to favourites from now on.
there we go, I'm just trying to create a little pattern or design so I could at least have both of those colours on there. Ah, it's so pretty! Oh my gosh, I love it! So I'm still using the same, the previous blanket. So you could see a little bit of a shimmer on, on the thumb when I did it, but it wasn't it wasn't as popping as, as it could be. So I'm just going to go in, clean my brush up quickly. Got my little lint free wipe there. So yeah, we're going to try this one for the next finger. Yeah, got a bit confused there, forgot which finger I was painting on. I like all these colours. I really do. They apply on so smoothly. I could just play with them all day long. I'm just trying to show you what it looks like. This camera just doesn't do them justice at all. So far, this has got to be one of my favorite project, um, projects. <laughs> favorite videos so there we go there is the magnet you can see a little bit shifting around there see a bit more there it's incredible how it just does that so you can play around with this to get you know whatever effect you want with it I think the closer you have the magnet to your finger the darker it goes but I just wanted to have that little bit of a shimmer there you can see me wiggling my fingers around just so the light can catch it Even this green is really nice. I don't have a lot of greens in my collection. But I do like this one. No, oh, I like all of them. I can't pick a favourite. They're just all so beautiful. You have to let me know which one is your favourite when they're all done. There we go. Look at that green. That's amazing. Look, can you see it shifting? That's just incredible, isn't it? There we go. Look at that shift. It's like wizardry. <laughs> wizardry for nails. Wow, look at that. So we're gonna go in on my fourth finger. I had to think for a second there. Probably applying too much of this colour on, but um, yeah, just I'm so in love with it. I really, really love this set. Azure Beauty, you have done well on this one. So here I come with my magnet again. This time I'm using a different side of it. There you go. You can really see that, you know, colour shifting around there. And I'm going in with a pinky now. You should paint that on. Oh, that color is just so stunning. How could you not love these colors? You could probably create like really lovely patterns with this but you know just for the purpose of this video I just want you just to, to see what it looks like. There we go and I'm going to come in a bit closer so you can see that shifting motion there. It's 
also now if you create a pattern that you don't like you can always just go over it again with your um, cat eye gel like I'm doing now and you can basically recreate your pattern again because you've painted over um, your previous layer there we go you can see that kind of shifting and shimmering Yoy! I'm so excited! I really, really love these colors. It's just so beautiful. Look at that. You can see them all shimmering. <laughs> and now, my favorite part top coat time. I love top coat. I could spend all day just watching you know people doing top coat over nails it just brings everything all together and crisps it all up yeah so And I'm going to cure this for 60 seconds in my lamp. Yay, I'm back. That was a very quick 60 seconds. <laughs> so that's all of the colours again. I'm going to just wipe them over with my um, cleansing solution. And there you go. You can see all the colours now. And I've got my vitamin E oil. Just going to go over it. Nourish my nails a bit. Look at that. I'm just going to wipe that over so you can see that color. Yay! Guys, let me know what you think. What do you think of these colors? Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching.